Hello, today I would like to demonstrate you how to deform uh, bitmap images using bones in uh, Synfig. This is uh, a new feature uh, implemented by Ivan Mahonin in April and uh, as you will see it is very easy to use. So let's start. Here I'm going to import an image. Let's make it a bit smaller. So here we have an image. Now let's add a, a skeleton deformation layer. For now it resides in uh, other subcategory, probably it should be moved to distortions, but for now it's here. So let's add it. Here it is. So here we have just one bone. So it's and deform deforms our image. If we will add another bone and it this creates some deformation. But this is not what we want. What we really want is to put an initial uh, skeleton, to define initial skeleton structure to see uh, which parts are linked to which bone. So uh, we need to switch to initial position mode. Uh, we can do that by disabling the skeleton deformation layer. Like this. And now we can place uh, bones where we want them to be and define the uh, general structure. Like this. Now we have defined the skeleton structure and now we switch back to uh, well deformation mode by enabling skeleton deformation layer. And now we see everything is messed up. This is because the pose is not synced yet, uh, but it is easy to fix. We just right click and choose reset pose and we've got uh, our bones at the initial position. And now we can uh, easily deform our image and even create a simple animation. And uh, of course we can uh, switch back to initial position and uh, well make some tweaking uh, if we want to. Uh, also we can uh, reset pose and at any moment. This is without a problem. And uh, well let's undo. What I want to, uh, final thing what I want to mention is uh, that uh, uh, that uh, skeleton deformation layer works not for images only but for any graphics what you will create in Synfig. So let's uh, create a simple star here. It's pony like, I think. And let's enable deformation layer and as you can see 
uh, it's in the format just like the image. So this is a very powerful tool for creating simple and quick animations. I hope you like you will like it. Well, that's all. Thank you and goodbye.